Renee here for Blaze.com. I am on the yellow and black striped carpet for the DreamWorks premiere of B Movie. We're about to talk to all the celebrities and stars, so let's go find out what the buzz is all about. Golden Blossom, Ray Liotta Private Select. Is it easier to play yourself animated or live action? Well, live action is always more fun to, to play something that's not really who you are. And actually, this isn't exactly the way I would behave, but uh, it, it was fun. This was just a lot, a lot of fun. The most fun about writing with Jerry Seinfeld is making him laugh. He's a big laugher, and most people don't know that. And when you say a, a joke that makes him laugh, he'll laugh forever. And he might even fall on the floor. It is my sincere desire that this movie brings together children and bees so they, they, they can play together and, and sting and slap each other. Because wouldn't that be sweet? I think one of the highlights was our first recording session with Jerry and Chris Rock, where I feel like we should have paid admission to have those two just go off and riff and improv together for three hours. It was really a great, great time. Oof. Just keep still! You're not dead? I'm going to Alaska. I'm going to Tacoma. What about you? He really is yes. dead. So were you afraid of bees at all? Um, a little bit. Yeah, I'm allergic. Well, there's one dead on the ground right there, so <laughs> oh, we're okay. Yeah, I should rescue it, though. I feel guilty all the time now. <laughs> I think one of the biggest problems was um, he kept on making everybody off, including himself, so he couldn't record anything. So he'd be laughing on the floor. Can you get off the floor, please? We need to record you. Stop laughing. So that's why the movie took four years, right? Yeah, he kept on laughing. <laughs> um, there's a moment in the movie that I just love, and that's the moment where Vanessa, the human woman, picks up Barry and under a glass and takes him over to the ledge of the window and lets him go. And in that moment, they bond and their friendship begins. And I think that, to me, is like crystallizes what the movie's about. We just want to know, are you afraid of bees or have been stung by a bee? I have been stung by a bee, but I look right back at them. No, I don't. I scream. <laughs> That's right, I scream. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, screaming. Renee, do you like bees like your character does, or have you ever been stung? I'm indifferent. I kind of leave them alone and let them do their thing and don't get involved. <laughs> Jerry, hi. hi. So this has been four years. It's obviously been a labor of love for you. You put the bee suit on at cons. When did your love affair with bees begin? Um, really when I started making the movie and I started really reading the books about them and finding out really how they live and what they do. And I just found them to be like the most fascinating little world of the hive. So it was really fun to recreate it. I just don't think the audience is ever really going to believe I'm a bee. So I had a great time here on the yellow and black carpet. We talked to all the stars. We talked to Jerry. We talked to Brene. And now they're inside watching Bee Movie. For Blaze Media, I'm Andrea Brene at the Bee Movie premiere. Catch me on the Daily Dose.